Okay, so I'm going to show you how you can transfer all of your information from your Samsung Galaxy, all the Galaxy series, the all the uh, Galaxy S's, the Notes, the J's, the A's, uh, the Megas, the Neos, everything to your new iPhone. Okay, but for this example, I'm using a Samsung Galaxy S6 here, and I'm using a iPhone iPhone 6s. Okay, now this is so easy to do. You don't need no cables or anything. We'll, we're going to be using an app. It's a. Uh, it's called uh, Move to iOS. Is right here. And again, this is my Android, and this is my. Or this is my Samsung Galaxy S6, and this is my iPhone. Okay. Now, first thing is this. Okay. Now, before you transfer everything over um, to your iPhone, you basically have to be in the setup process on your iPhone. So, for like in my case, I had a, I. I already been using my iPhone 6s, so I just backed up some photos and videos, and I did a factory reset. And then once you start going to the. Um, the setup process, like right here, I just basically um, reformatted or did a factory reset on my iPhone. So I'm going to go ahead and move to this process here. And let me just go through this process here, and I'll show you the page that it comes on. So now once you get the here, it says apps and data. Then from here, of course, you can, you know, on your iPhone, you can restore from uh, iCloud or iTunes. You can set up as a new phone, or you can move data from Android. So I'm just simply going to click on this right here, and it says move from Android. And it says, uh, if you have an Android phone or tablet, you can transfer your photos, messages, and more to this iPhone. And it says download the Move to iOS app on your Android device to get started. So here is the iOS Move to iOS um, app here. I already downloaded it, so I'm going to go ahead and click on Open here. And then I'm going to click on Continue. And then I'm going to agree to this. And then I'm going to click on next. This is find your code. I'm going to click on next. Now on my iPhone, I'm going to click on continue. And here is my code that I need to enter in here, okay? Now I can't enter it here because um, this is for a six digit code, but I have a 10 digit code. So I need to select I have a 10 digit code. And then from here, I'm going to type in my code. All right, give this a second to connect to the iPhone. And I mean, with this, guys, I mean, it's really easy. I mean, you'll be able to move all of your contacts, all of your like your text messages, your SMS text messages, all your fit, uh, photos and videos, all your bookmarks, all your Gmail accounts will transfer as well. And you have uh, options which one you want to pick. And I'll show you a second in the process. The only thing is with the Gmail accounts, it's not going to transfer your passwords either. So if you have a lot of Gmail accounts, you're going to have to manually insert your password uh, once it's on the uh, on the iPhone here. So give this a second here. It's uh, preparing here now. Okay, now it says transfer data here. It says choose what you would like to copy to your iPhone. And, of course, you have your Gmail account, your text messages, your contacts, and your camera roll, which is your videos and, fo and um, photos. So I'm just going to click on Next. I'm going to go ahead and just make sure all these are selected. I'm going to click on Next. And now I'm going to let this process, the transfer, uh, continue. Okay, so the transfer is complete here. It says your data has been copied to your new iPhone or iPad. Some items were not copied, such as purchased apps or media, or media that is saved within apps. Okay, so I'm going to click, click on done here. I mean, the transfer is complete. Okay, however, it is um, still moving into place now on the iPhone. Okay, so you're pretty much done with your, uh, your Galaxy phone at this point. Gives us a second here to get done moving everything. And then once everything is done moving here, and I'll go ahead and show you uh, what happens after this is done, but basically it's going to put you back into the setup process, uh, basically where you left on. And again, once um, you go back to the setup process and everything is complete, then you'll be able to see all of your contacts, your uh, text messages, your photos, videos, uh, your bookmarks, all your Gmail accounts. And like I said earlier, you have to go back into all your Gmail accounts and enter all, you know, re-enter all of your passwords as well. So now it says uh, transfer complete. Now I just click on continue, setting up iPhone. And then you start off from here with the, um, from the Apple ID, and then you just 
uh, continue from there. And uh, all the stuff I just mentioned will be on your iPhone. If you guys have any questions or anything, comment below. If you guys subscribe, like, or share, that'll be awesome. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.